Oh yeah, look at this, baby. We're gonna go Luke Skywalker. Oh, if you haven't seen season two of The Mandalorian, sorry, spoiler alert, warning, Luke Skywalker. <laughs> sorry, this, this thing is so cool. This is so cool. The Falcon Eyes Ursa 1. Ursa 1. It's like a tube light and it's RGB. You can't ever get enough RGB. This thing is gonna be so good. What's up guys? If you're new here, my name is Paul and I run a channel that inspires other creators that your future is whatever you make it. I do that through gear reviews, tutorials, and today is, oh yeah, more gear reviews and oh man, if you like this type of content, feel free to smash that subscribe button because dang it. It's awesome. This thing is great. Falcon Eyes makes some cool stuff. And I, I mean, I got my like panel light over here. I mean, I got this little miniature RGB light with like magnets, like the Aperture MC style light. It's so good. And man, here we go. Here's another banger. And it comes with a nice case. I gotta appreciate companies that include nice cases. However, my closet is getting cluttered with a lot of nice cases because yeah. So what comes in the box? Well, you just got your user manual and the light itself, which is just sweet. This thing feels pretty sturdy. It's like a clear plastic all around here with like some little ends here. Got a lot of a quarter 20 and some looks like different type of power or something. I don't know. USB-C for updates and charging. That's awesome. And then you get to, it comes with a USB-C cable. Hallelujah, brands are starting to do USB-C. And gosh, I love USB-C, it's so good. And I know this thing is app controllable. I'm very curious if it's the same app that the other one is. Whoa. And all right, right away, right here we got this party started. Party start, I'm sure it's like, uh, what is this? Scene 20, all right, RGB mode. So we're just gonna go. It's almost like a. Oh, my Sith Lord! Dang it! And and oh my goodness! Who? They're attached. There we go. Let's let's try this real quick. Magnets are awesome. So anything that needs magnets, totally. All right, so I just like magnetized that back there. That looks pretty cool. Let's open up the app. Now, I'm assuming this is the same app as the rest of other falconized lights. So let's see what it is. It's the Sol light. It's been added. All right, let's see. Ha ha, and it's that easy. Boom, and now we got the full color. So we got green back there, we can go blue, teal blue, really bright blue, we'll go purple. It doesn't look like it on my monitor, but it's purple. Gerald and Dunn purple, let's see. Red. Orange. I don't know why you can't, it's like, maybe my monitor just is terrible. And you can change how like dim it is. Like this goes pretty much down to zero, like one percent right here. Up oh, zero, and then you go up a little bit. Oh yeah. So you can do the whole color wheel, and it just is. I mean, this thing is super bright. When I crank it down about halfway. You know. I mean, these colors are just these are cool. What a nice app. And then you got CTE. You got scenes. So you got like lightning. You can do like candle. Um, high beams, high beam bulb, oh, interesting. Get the police car, of course. Um, double flash, got regular flash. Oh, yeah, guys, whole layoff. Uh, strobe, Ooh. breathing, ambulance, that's cool. 
Then you have Red Flash. Party. But yeah, there's just, there's just so much with this light. You can do so much. It, even like you can import music, I guess, and it's supposed to like go to music or whatever. You can like take a picture or something. So I got a blue on the floor. Let's try that. Oh, here we go. So it picks up a blue. It's not bad. The, the app works pretty good. I really have enjoyed this app and it was really easy to sync. I literally just add to my phone, press the the add button and it goes and this light is so cool what is my favorite thing about lights rgb and magnets you have those two things on a light and it takes your light from being just amazing and if you didn't want to use the app you can still use like the screen it's got all these like power buttons here it's got a power button rotate between the modes to rotate between the buttons like the the functions on the actual mode you're on and then an up and down arrow to increase and decrease whatever setting you're on so it's pretty cool it's pretty basic you got a lot of stuff in here you got gels you've got channels so you can like I could turn this one on and my little small pocket one on at the same time and change it and have them sync the colors or I could put one on one channel and one on the other and control them differently on my phone this app and this ecosystem for lights falcon eyes is really getting so good at this and falcon eyes came out with another banger like i wish i could have another one of these what's the price range of this thing it's 150 bucks but for this quality and the build quality and the battery the built-in battery not going to worry about separate batteries to charge and this being usb-c you can put it in a battery bank or whatnot these are so cool to put in like the background of your scene, you know, just to have them sit there. It makes it look really cool. I like all those people who put like one on each side of them and just to add that dimension to your videos. Um, tube lights are a fantastic way to do that, especially when they're RGB. And this got all the different, you know, 5500, 2300 Kelvin, 3200 Kelvin, all that's all in this thing with RGB and it's great. It's super cool. I would pick up another one and it's on my list. Honey, if you see this, pick up another one of these because you know I'm a light whore and I can't ever get enough of them. All right, yep, another Amazon buy. Another Amazon buy that just, thank you, Vu Nugent. Thank you. Vu from NVU Films, you sold me. I saw this light on your video and I was like, I gotta get one. Thanks, Vu. And now I'm going to do the same thing to somebody else. If you guys like this kind of content, this is a cool light to add to your arsenal. This is, you know, I got more lighting reviews on my channel. I'm going to have more stuff on my Sony camera. I just switched to an A7C. So feel free to like, subscribe, do all the fun youtube -y things. And you know that I will see you in the future. Sorry, this, this thing is so cool. This is so cool.